Hi, today we will be explaining portable temporary ground or simply PTG. So what is portable temporary ground? PTGs are the portable devices that are used to temporarily connect the de-energized electrical equipment or conductor to the ground. The size and rating of the grounding cables are determined as per international standards for different voltage ranges. Highly insulated portable sticks are used for connecting the grounding cables to the conductor or other electrical equipment. So, what is the purpose of using portable temporary grounds? PTGs provide protection to the worker and the equipment in case the circuit is energized by mistake. PTGs drain electrostatic and electromagnetic induced voltages. PTGs provide positive proof for electrical isolation. PTGs provide bonding. Now we explain the correct procedure for applying the portable temporary ground. The portable sticks used for applying PTGs must be approved and designed as per international standards. Safety gloves must be used in damp weather while applying PTG. Grounding stick must be held away from the body while applying or removing PTG. The cables used for grounding must be in healthy condition and of proper size as per voltage requirements of the system. When applying PTG, always connect cable with the ground first and then to the line. This is done to avoid any risk of electrical shock because if there are induced voltages in the line and the worker connect the grounding cable with the line first, the worker can be subjected to electric shock. Similarly, when removing PTG, first remove the cable from line and then from ground. Protective glasses must be worn to protect the eyes while applying or removing PTG. Before applying PTG, line teasing must be carried out. Line teasing is basically the hearing of buzzing sound when the ground stick's metallic head is brought near to the energized line. In case the line is found to be energized during line teasing, then the ground stick must be connected to the line immediately. After doing so, the earth fault relay will automatically trip the circuit after sensing the earth fault. In case the worker gets nervous and remove the grounding cable away from the transmission line, heavy electrical arc will be established due to the interruption of current and will result in electric shock to the worker. PTGs should be applied to all the three phases, even if the work is being carried out on a single phase. This is done because of two major reasons. Number one, the worker may touch the other phases by mistake. If other phases are not grounded, the worker will be subjected to electrical shock. Number two, three-phase stripping is faster than single-phase stripping, so the fault will be clear soon. Hopefully the video was helpful. Keep in touch for more videos.